most interesting aspect of being a Kaiser chief front Ricky man Wilson. right now, uh, Mr Ricky Wilson, is what the <laughs> about-to-be Prime Minister once called you. Yeah. He Can wants, you remember? Uh, an uh, epic softy. Epic softy and a bunch of weeds from Leeds. Well, you know... <laughs> I'm not sure he wrote it. <laughs> well, what we got did someone I... else to do it this for him. He was, he was London mayor and was talking about the riots and, you know, you guys have predicted riots and so on, not blaming you, really. Um, well, but... no, he, he didn't come home from holiday for the riots. Right. Yeah. But, no, he said, he said that when I was a lad, um, <laughs> rock stars incited riots. They didn't just predict them. <laughs> That's endorsing violence, Boris. Well, you once said you'd have to get that printed on a T-shirt. Yes, epic softies or, or weeds from Leeds. Yeah, we got it done for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Can I keep this? It's for you. Oh, really dumb. This will be Boris available. Johnson says I'm an epic softy. That'll there be available at our <laughs> merch stand <laughs> January and February during the tour. What do you uh, What Oops, do you make what? of our political situation right now? Uh, I'm watching Love Island instead. It's, do you know uh, what? I think less, a lot of people feel less like complicated. that. Less complicated, more intelligent. And answering expect. questions more clearly. Yes. As well. What do you love about Love Island other than those fantastic uh, attributes? I, I, I find it quite um, soporific before I go to bed. It um, puts me boring. into stupor. No, I, uh, I like it. Talking of stupor, do you not find them just breathtakingly stupid? Oh, yeah, that makes me feel quite good about myself. <laughs> I'm equally feeling bad about my body and good about my brain. <laughs> yes. So I think that's quite yeah. good. But you see, my problem with Love Island is it plays right into this sort of modern phenomenon that everything has to be body perfect. Everyone, yeah. everyone has to look like they've been sculpted. We do, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> we do. You know, I really don't like this movement. You know, no, no, no. I prefer the old-fashioned yeah. body. You don't want to be an object, do you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I don't want people looking at me and just seeing, just seeing a beefcake. Yeah, they don't see through the perfection, <laughs> the, the mind behind it. But um, being, being the lead singer of a band like the Kaiser Chiefs, a global successful band. Uh -huh. when, you were, when you were a kid mucking around with music, you must dream of that moment. You're out there in a big stadium rocking it. And yeah. there you are, suddenly you're that guy. It, yeah, what was it, it like the, to achieve the reality of the dream? Well, it was, it, it was weird, because on the one hand it was an overnight sensation, but um, it took a long time to get to that night. It was a very long day. Mm. Um, but, uh, you know, the quicker you get something like that, I think the quicker it's taken away from you. So I was really lucky that no one was interested until I was about 26. What's been the most pinch me moment for you with the guys that you? Interesting. Pinch me. Pinch me. I hope it hasn't happened yet. I'd like to, you know, because we keep getting, they keep letting us do it. Yeah. And yeah. No one's stopping us. Well, what else have you got to achieve? I mean, all um, success, but. Is there something you haven't done you want to do? Well, you've got a single that's... out now, haven't you? And you've got the album. Yeah. But that's a great, strong fan base, if it is like that. Yeah, but then again, I mean, although they're always with us and they'll buy records, which is fantastic, and we really appreciate that, mm. it's about trapping new customers. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A new fan base. Are you out on tour as well? Always. <laughs> always, always on the road. Probably playing today. Isn't that the only? <laughs> they don't start without me. Sometimes. Isn't that the only way to make proper money these days as a musician? Yeah. Um, to be on tour. Well, I, I, I've got enough. <laughs> You're not doing it for the money, are you, Ricky? You're doing it for it the love and the music. Uh, no, no, I do, we do it because the, the alternative of not doing it is just unthinkable. Yeah. Quite, There's been right. times when it's been nearly taken away and we're like a kid with a toy. As soon as someone yeah. else shows interest, we want it. Well, you're a great story. band. Uh, it's you. probably very damaging to your brand for me to admit that in public, that yeah. I like you, but uh. I do. You're a great guy. Nice to meet you. <laughs> you uh, best of luck with the album, the single, the tour, yeah. and all your continued success, Ricky oh. Wilson. Nice to see you.